All right, let's get started. Happy Tuesday, everyone. How are we all doing today? Who's ready for some more Renegade Platinum Snaplock? It's me. I'm here. I exist. What are we doing? How's everybody? How's everybody doing today? What's up, Safe Luma? Twiggly Bug, thank you for the follow. Let's good. Let's good indeed, the Dracovish. Let's good indeed. Hi. Hello, Pixie Pepistar. Pixie Pepistar? Stealth Hiki. Captain America t-shirt is on point. Indeed. Indeed. Because we're going to use only Crawdont for this stream. Only Cap. This is a complete accident. I'm going to be entirely honest. It's just a comfy shirt. Hi, Flagon. Just watch your black 2 white 2 tier list on YouTube. Thanks, Malcon. Glad you enjoyed that. Cell Kid missed. Hi, Flagon. First time catching a stream live content. Thanks. Thanks. I appreciate it. Thanks. What's up? Not much, Rodriguez. What's up with you? Arrow Gamers says, yo, yo, yo. You killed it with the last video, Doc. Thank you. I'm really proud of that one. I really like how that one turned out. Um, it was a lot of fun to make. Uh, it's, it's one of my favorites um, recently. So how's the stream going? The stream has just gotten started, Zigzag Zorb. Um, we have beaten Riley as of last stream. So we are heading into Iron Island, basically. Um, the cave of Iron Island. But we should probably go heal and stuff. Um, we have a new encounter here. We can either get um, Probopass or the other guy. Probopass or Sableye. Honestly, I think I want Probopass. But, yeah. What does Flygon Hello, prescribe Flygon. for encounters on Iron Island? Psychology lecture right now. What up, Key Dickens? Thank you for the two months. You're in a psychology lecture right now. Lecture right now. Psychology, huh? I don't have a I don't have I don't have a response to that. There's I not much. Sorry. I was trying to come up with something, but Alice. Alice, Alice, Alice. Pro bro pass, indeed. Yeah, nose pass or uh the other one I said. Nose pass or um Sableye. I'm hoping for nose pass. We could use another steel type that isn't quite as flimsy as old Mawile over here, but we'll see. Sableye. Let's let's look at these move sets that old Sableye has. Sableye, not disable. Sableye. Oh my god, it still could stall. How could you do this to me, Dreano? How could you do this? Um, at 43 to 45, he'll have Mean Look, Nasty Plot, Shadow Ball, and Sucker Punch. Kind of hate that. I kind of hate that for you. Although, I guess you just get completely walled by a normal type, so that's that's fine. Um, Sableye, okay. And then Nose Pass at 41 to 43. Nose Pass at 41 to 43. I'm going to try and not... Kill all of these things. Lock on, Zap Cannon, Stone Edge, Earth Power, Thunderbolt, Sandstorm. It's a it's a Sableye though. So uh, I mean it's a nose pass. Tongue, I got called out for listening to stream because I need to go in on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I got called out for listening to stream because I need to go in on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Still worth it. Who'd you get called out by? Me? Do you want to do my college level algebra homework? Kinda. Kinda. What's, uh, what's... Hit, hit me with it. Hit me with it. I don't know. Sure. What's the clock for you? The time? La tiempo? Is that what you are asking for? The tiempo. What is the time for you and me? That is what I want to know. Yes, 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 very much. Ooh, um, let's go get Whiskash, because Whiskash is a good Sableye answer. Oh, yep, the audio is loud. Sorry. Um, thanks for reminding me. I had to record something, so I had to raise it. I was doing some other recording. Thanks for the heads up. Or thanks for the, uh, bringing it to my attention. 
Um. Wiggler, 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 ta! What? Um. Is there a way to put any of these homies to sleep? Uh, catching Pokemon in this game is so annoying, man. Just hack it, Master Balls, call it a day, Jafiel. Where's my normal Dark type? Where's my, um, Galarian Zigzagoon? It's just simplifying trinominals. Trinominals? Trinomials? I'll simplify trinomials, why not? In Galar? Oh! Oh, in Galar, huh? We got a cheeky son of a gun in tra in chat. I see. Uh, licky, licky, you know what? Licky, licky, you can... You can come out. Um... And then... Maybe one other fella for Earth Power... Bring Chimeco, I guess. Is kind of a fast little fella, right? Was there Golbats in here? Ugh. Oh, is he not really all that fast? Well, whatever. Golbat doesn't learn Giga Drain by level up in this game, does it? I recently learned there's a cheat for opening the PC anywhere, makes it less tedious. Yeah, yeah, I've heard of that, I've heard of that, all right, yeah, you know it, bruv. Mobile is not letting me put in a, an equation, bummer, 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 you gotta be bloody joking me with that bummer. Speaking of bummers. I hardly know her. Yeah, okay, this is good. Ooh, heat rock, no. Bummer, I hardly know her. La, 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 la. We should probably teach Wigglytuff a move that we can actually damage the old the old fellow with. Good evening, Flygon HG. How are you doing? I can't complain. How about you? I mean, I could. One can always complain. Here, let's give him Thunderbolt. The question is, how are you, Mossy LFC? Enough about me. Tell me about you. Um. All right. So here's the. Ooh, had a little bit of a hiccup there. Here's the deal. Take me away on this boat, man. Guys, you know what I realized that we should probably fix at some point this stream. I think, I feel like we should probably, ooh, Ninja asks at 53. That's spicy. All right, I had to do that so that he would guarantee the, the outspeed or whatever, right? 
Well, let's get everybody to 50. Hydro pump. Yo, WM8, thank you so much for the sub via Prime. Folks, dare I say it? I dare. Folks, did you know that if you have Amazon Prime, you're sitting on a fat wad of cash? You're paying for something you're not using? If you have Amazon Prime, you can link your Prime account to your Twitch account and subscribe for free. It is literally pissing money down the drain if you aren't subscribed to somebody every month. You're paying for it. So use it. Nilla used it. Or Nia, depending. I don't know. She used it. You make it, you make putting postages on 300 plus envelopes way more interesting. That's bait. You're trying to bait me into asking, what are you putting postages on 300 plus envelopes for? Well, I'm not going to do it drawing crows. No, I'm just kidding. What are you doing? What are you doing? But why would we take money from Jeffrey Bezos's pocket? Because Jeffrey Bezos sucks. Spoiler alert. He sucks. All right, let's do it. Work for the post office? I don't, I can't imagine you have to do that as a job at the post office, right? Like not in a row. Law office makes a lot of sense. I thought you were gonna, I thought you were gonna do the whole, um, the whole uh, wedding thing, you know? All right, let's go, let's go get this. What were you going to fix this stream? You didn't finish your sentence. Please don't leave me hanging. Sorry, now I have to explain to this four-year-old why Jeffrey Bezos kind of sucks inherently. So we have to do that now instead of the whole the whole thing I was gonna do. No, um we we should we should do another gen of the horse tier ranking. I've been meaning to do that. We left it hanging. We've only gone one. We've only gone one. We've only got one gen. One gen. Okay, this is this will be the tricky thing. How do we escape these goal bats, you know? I'm hoping that Quake will surprise me here. Quake did not surprise me. Um wait, does this Golbat have mean luck by any chance? Nah 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 nah. Oh son of a crap. Your favorite horse, Steelix? Um, Golbats are stupid Pokemon. OMFG, the horse thing? I think you should say, OMFG, the horse thing! Because it's fun. <laughs> All right, nose pass is what it is. We did not get Sableye, we got nose pass. I'll take it. Um... Nose pass at 42, nose. Stone Edge, Earth Power, Thunderbolt, and Sandstorm. So here we go. Here we go. Make this easy for me, Nosy. Come on, baby. One ball HG. One ball HG. You think you'll ever do a challenge run of Inclement Emerald again? Cowboy Banshee, thank you for the four months. Another month, another sub. Thank you, thank you. When endangered, it may protect itself by raising its magnetism and drawing iron objects to its body. All right, so what um, what Marvel character is nosy? This would actually have been a pretty good one for Modok, but... What about, like... Oh man, I don't even remember what we've named these things. Korg, Magneto, but this is a little lady. Magneta, yeah. Magneta, Magneta. 
Polaris word. Yeah, let's do that. And Peggy. HG stands for horse genius. It actually stands for horse god, but um, close enough. I'll allow it. All right. Let's go look at Nosy. All right. We oops. We uh we have to go through the whole Iron Island. That's kind of lousy, isn't it? Is there a woman with a mustache? Hell if I know. Um all right, what do you got here for me, Nosy? Impish. That's um that's pretty cracked. It's pretty GD cracked, baby. Let's go. And sturdy, that's totally useless, but um whatever. So Damn, look at that defense. One fucking 40. Pro bro pass indeed. Isn't she a special attacker? Not really. Like, kind of. But who cares? All she does is pivot. All she does is pivot. It's fine. Dum, dum, da, dum. I'd much rather have the, more, the additional defense. What up, Dirty Ox? Great Zealous, thank you so much for the 12 months. Cool, okay, so. Um, great. Yo, deceptively underscore, thank you so much for the three months. That's very exciting. Pro bro pass. My homie pro bro pass. All right, so um, we're going to have to fight some, like, ace trainers and shit. Unfortunately, these are kind of annoying because the Lucas Ario just sits there and does nothing. Big dumb dick. But, um... Wait. Question... Does Riley? Does Riley use all of his Pokemon or is it still only the Lucario? Masquerain, Cradley, Hippowdon, Gardevoir, Lopunny, and Medicham? That's terrifying. Oh, right. You can, you can do single. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, you're right. You can single battle these. You can't single battle the galactic grunts. The galactic grunts. The galactic grunts are mandatory double battles. All right, Manetric. You gonna be a champ here? No, not really. How do you do so effing little? Where's my physical? Wow. Just wow. And I can't breathe without you, but I have to. All right, there's only one thing that we can do with this Manette trick or against this, this Masquerade. It's murder it, murder it outright. Quite right, quite right. How's your day going? It's good, leader 999M. How's your day going? God, people are so friendly. And I can't breathe without you, but I have to. Um. But I have a freaking. What is a POC in Sapphire? Oak. Oh, Professor Oak Challenge. Is that what it is? I'm guessing. It's 
probably what it is. Great Zealous has resumed, redeemed a five minute movie review. Okay. Well, we're waiting. This, um, this masquerade is fast AF. Have you seen 2012 Chronicle? I freaking love 2012 Chronicle. What a banger of a flick. What a picture. Is that what you want to redeem? All right, peace, gun tank. Yo, Robo Creepar, thank you so much for the raid. You're right in time for me to wax poetically about Chronicle 2012. I adore it. It's a shame that Josh Trank is in director jail now because that movie's really great. I love that movie. I think that movie, it's a found footage movie. Man, I love your videos. Thank you, Robo Creepar. Chronicle is a found footage movie where three kids in high school just randomly get superpowers. And it's kind of about that. And frankly, it's freaking awesome. It's an awesome freaking movie. Would highly recommend. Um, oh, no, no, no. Punch crow, crow, crow. Um, and so I, the reason I really love it is because there's been a lot of like, oh, what if superheroes but real, rah, 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 right? Like that like that type of thing. But this is the one that feels the most as if it was actually thought out and the characters actually acted as teenagers. Um, it just has, I don't know, it just has some really interesting performances from, uh, what's his name? Dane DeHaan. It's got my boy Michael B. Jordan in it. This is Chronicle 2012 Inferno Corbinite. And, uh, yeah, it's just, I personally, personally, think it's a very well done movie. Um, well done flick, good feature. Um, it's got really cool action. It actually uses the found footage conceit in an interesting way. Um, and it's just very well plotted. It's a shame the screenwriter is like a terrible, horrible piece of garbage. Because that, that yeah, full disclosure, you do have to know that going into it. Max Landis kind of sucks as a human. But other than that, um, I think it holds up surprisingly well. I saw it again recently, like a month ago. Definitely one of the best found footage films. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's not particularly close. Like... Not a whole lot of, uh, you know, competition in the found footage genre, if I if I got to be honest. But uh, yeah, it is it is quite good. It is quite good. Um, how are you doing? I'm doing good, Jaguar Studios. Why do you have a little palm tree? TwitchCon 2022 San Diego. Folks, I'm so excited to go to TwitchCon in San Diego. I liked Cloverfield. Eh, eh it's all right. It's up there. It's up there. Tight, tight. You know, tight. Here is what I want to do. I want to go blossom to kill this stupid summon a gun.
I see, I see, I see, I see. What am I, um... What is this? Is... Hmm. Alright, well, we gotta bring core fish core. Surely. Surely. Oh, you know who just dusts Cradley is our boy Parasect. L to the yeah. Look at Leech Life just absolutely dusting our boy Cradley. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Um, Ace Trainer Jonah, more like Ace Trainer Chump. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, Blair Witch Project. Eh. At the time, it was probably real sick, but I'll tell you, watching it in 2020 in the height of a pandemic when you've already watched a ton of other crap, eh, you know? It's all right. Um, Where's Blossom? Blossom was going to come and do a thing. All right, so these three take out the various persons. We'll bring Alteria for fly support. Mary Jane, you are not coming, probably. Mama's hooked on Mary Jane. Daddy's hooked on Mary Kane. Um, maybe one day I'll learn the actual lyrics to that song. Okay, so Brenda has Gardevoir, Lopunny, and Medicham. Can we get Gardevoir? All right, Brenda. We're like, Brendum. <laughs> yeah, Mawile kills that just fine. Except, kind of not, huh? Nah, bro, this is fine, bro. Nah, bro, bro, you don't even, bro, you don't even understand, bro. This is fine, bro. Okay, okay, bro. Yeah, bro, you don't even, you don't even get it, bro. So, okay, so then, who comes out next? Medicham, who only has Zen Headbutt. Yeah, all right, all right. I, I, buy, I buy it. Whatever. Ask no questions, get no answers, so to speak. And then, Lopunny. Here's a question. It's a question. I can ask one. Have you ever been in a crowded room? 15 minutes later, they're all laughing too. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. What did I use to absolutely destroy the last one? Oh, right. It was uh, Exeggutor. Exeggutor just pops this homie like a, like a grape. Grape Scott. Gracious, great balls of fire. Oh, 
Oh! Someday! Uh, Altaria kind of handles this perfectly fine, too. Mr. Perfectly Fine. Great. All right, let's do it. I love it when Mati gets into his stream of consciousness and it's like a one-play game of word association. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> That's a good way to put it. Oh, but... Nah, it's fine. Okay, so, um... Ooh, but... Maybe it's not fine. Wait, let's let's go back and parasect. Let's go, let's go, uh, uh, Joner over here. Nah, it's fine. I mean, he's faster. Sar. Eh. Long time viewer, first time chatter. Thanks for the content. I always watch during my lunch break. Ah. Lunch break, the time for lunch. Uh, Lumberry. Oops. Long time viewer first. I already read that. Do, 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 do. La Punny, it is I, hello, hello, Punny. Hello, uh huh, hello, Punny. Uh huh, hello, Punny. Um, can I ask you a question? Have you ever been in a crowded room? 15 minutes they were laughing too. What did you do? Ah. I have like a select list of vids I like to rewatch, and all of your videos are there. It's you and Jaden that inspired me to do nose logs. Aww. Well, that's lovely. I don't know what else to say about that other than it's lovely. It's simply marvelous. It's very kind of you to say. Okay, so, um,. Twisted spoon. I don't want a spoon that's not twisted. I'll kill everyone if I don't get a twisted spoon. Actually, wise glasses is fine. Wait, is it? Uh oh. Oh god. Yeah, no, it's fine. Okay, so um, great, great, great. We have reviewed your PhD, and us at Oxford University would like to offer you the prestigious title of professor. If you would like to accept, please let us know. Nice try. You're not getting me back into indentured servitude. Thank you very much. What? It leftovers. Okay. It's a tiny mushroom. Tiny, tiny mushroom. Give this homie a citrus berry just in case worse comes to worse and the thing crits. That would be kind of embarrassing. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I play old videos to fall asleep too, especially your older videos where you got a calm voice the whole time. Yee, 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 yee. Those were the days. When people mistook me having a calm voice as me just being incredibly shy on the mic. No, wait, other way around. People mistook me being incredibly shy on the mic as me having an extremely calm voice. There's nothing calm about me. I'm crazy, baby. You can't, I, I'm un, unpredictable. You can't, you can't, you never expect the Spanish Inquisition. Did your brother call you yet? No, that fucker didn't call me, but he did text me. So I'll allow it. 
Hard to sleep through a modern Richard Vendetta rant. What's a Richard Vendetta? Oh, Richard Vendetta rant. Like my vendetta against Richard. I thought Richard Vendetta was a person. Which is a pretty sick ass name for a human being. If you if your name is Richard Vendetta, hit me up. I want to get to know you, you know? Like I want to know the man behind the name of Richard Vendetta. That's a that's a banger name, you know? Got to change my name that is sick. Yeah. Fat White Duke just invented the illest name this side of uh, Johnny Utah. What, um, all right. Richard Vendetta is a French. Yeah, yeah we can't hold that against him. Boom blast. Next video, give us the Richard backstory. Mayhaps, mayhaps, mayhaps. Mayhaps. Dick Detta. <laughs> Ditchard Detta. All right, so homie here has to be at 52 to outspeed the little masquerade or what have you. That's fine. Let's do that now. I can't get over how sick of a name Richard Vendetta is. That's so awesome. The name's Richard. Richard Vendetta. And the name's Vendetta. Richard Vendetta. You know? Damn. Damn. <laughs> Stream's over. We peaked. We came up with a sick alias. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna make a movie that's like our G-Lay. Except for instead of Argile, it's going to be called Vendetta. And it's going to be about the true agent Vendetta. And his first name will be Richard. Richard Vendetta, played by Henry Cavill. It's time to find out who the real agent Vendetta is. Please call me Dick. Mr. Vendetta was my father. Richard Vendetta versus Dick Detta. Battle of the Ages. Are Richard Vendetta and Dick Detta two different people or is it the same person using like like is it like an alter ego thing you know how like poppy has several alter egos maybe that hasn't been maybe i haven't revealed that bit of poppy lore yet but poppy is kind of a kind of gotta watch out for her when her when her and she gets going. Dick Detta. All right. Full steam ahead, little boat. All right. So how do I, as a human being who is not always the brightest, get through this without going the wrong way? Well, step one, that was the wrong way. The British always named our Richard's dick. Yeah, I don't know why they do that. Maybe it's like a sex thing. Maybe it's a kink. I don't know. What um what is what does this lady have? Slash can we comfortably fight her? Picnicker Summer has Grovile, Firo, and Raichu. 
Ugh. Ugh. I'm gonna throw up in my mouth from this Grovile and Raichu crap. Now we Gucci. Sucker! All right, here we go. Sucker! Ugh. Eat my shorts, lady. Stupid summer. <laughs> yeah, the solstice called. She wants her first name back. Richard Vendetta, new SSG revenge playthrough, dismantling Team Rocket's resurgence due to the previous regime destroying your hometown and making you an orphan. As a British person named Richard, I can't say why, but I can confirm it leads to a tumultuous school period. School session. What up, Riles? It's Tuesday, isn't it? Mati decided to go with Riley. Did Mati decide to go with Riley, or did Riley force himself upon Mati? Huh? All right, so how? It's like over this way, maybe? All right, Joma, Jonah, Joe nuts in my mouth. <laughs> I hate everything. All right, so, uh, Masquerade. So, even at minus one, Fly still gets the chill here. We yeah, add speed. We're Gooch to outspeed. Okay! Last time we had to do these ace trainers, I lost Pokemon, so... Chad, we should have done a prediction whether I would lose Pokemon here or not, but... We did not. Gunga Hub, thank you so much for the party. I'm a huge fan of your sibling. I assume you're related. Mask Rain. Okay, we did anticipate the Intimidate drop. Even after in Tim, this is 100%. It goes up. Onscrow sounds like a different, more legendary Pokemon. Okay, Hippowdon. Oh, you know what I didn't do, though? <laughs> Oops, I did not, um... Little Blossom over here. I did not give... Uh, the one move, so that was an oopsie-daisy. It's fine, Pepper's fine, Pepper's got this. Salt and pepper. Yeah, see, we, we're it's fine. We got this. I did not give her the whole uh, the old uh, the old uh, grass knots. This is not a one shot. Oh, you know what I kind of like here though. Send up that SD. Should be faster. Yeah. All right, homie. I'm going to set up the SD. Just get rid of that. Don't paralyze me. That's a crap load of damage. Holy moly artichokey. Well, it's a good thing that we still recover like a crap load. With Jija Drain here.
Good job, Peppa. Peppa! Don't do it, Hippowdon. You bloody bastard. You bloody bastard. You gotta be bloody joking me. That's why we had the lumberry. You greedy, greedy hippo. You, you hungry, greedy, hungry, hungry hippo. When are they going to make a movie off of a Hungry Hungry Hippos? They've already made Jumanji. They've already made Clue. They've already made some other third movie. When are they going to make Hungry Hungry Hippos? I just want to see CGI hippos rampaging through probably New York because it's the only place that movies are allowed to happen. But, you know, like, hit me up with the Hungry Hungry Hippo universe. Um, You know what? Setting up the sun? Bit stupid. Because um, now floor takes dry skin, so let's 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 wait for that. Let's um let's let's do a moonlight first. Hungry, hungry hippo cinematic universe. The the H H H C U. Yes. The Hungry, Hungry, Hungry Hippo... The Hungry, Hungry Hippo Cinematic Universe. So here's what I'm thinking. Game, movie one. Hungry, Hungry Hippos. Clean, simple, to the point. Oh, shit, that was not on purpose. Why did I do that? Well, it worked out. But this has mirror code, so that was that was a bit, a bit, a bit silly of me. Um, I'm not paying attention because I'm pitching the Hungry, Hungry Hippo Cinematic Universe. Okay, movie one. Hungry, hungry. Max, you took it from me. You took, you took the punchline. No, it was, it wasn't hungry or hungry or hippos. It was hungry, hungry, hungry hippos was going to be the second one. And then in hungry, hungry, hungry hippos, there's a post credit scene that introduces, um, I don't know. What's another, what's something else that can be in the hungry, hungry hippo universe? What's another game? What's that one where you like you're like pressing down teeth and then eventually the thing bites your hand off? The triple HCU. Candyland. Candyland. And then yeah, yeah, yeah. So right, so in Candyland, then they uh, you know. Shit gets real in Candyland because King Candy has commanded all the hippos, so the heroes from Hungry Hungry. Well, here's the question: before we before we really start letting our minds go wild with the Triple HCU, we have to decide: do we want the hippos to be antagonists or do we want them to be protagonists? And and. Or, I guess, do we want them to be antagonists that become protagonists in later films? I think that's a little cliche, personally. I think I would like them to just be antagonists. The Hungry Hungry, the HH, the Triple, the Triple HCU. No, actually, I don't know. Antagonists or not antagonists? To antag or not to tag, you know? That's, that's the question. It's, it's tough. Oh, Angry Birds would be sick. Yeah, Hungry Hungry Hippos and Angry Birds is perfect. Where does Cradley wait? So what's next? It's the 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 fellow with the Gardevoir, right? Morally gray hippos, like a Breaking Bad situation. The hippos are the heroes, but one of them is a spy for the other side, but turns for good during the movie climactic fight with the BBEG. What's the BBEG? You know what I do like, though, is actually... So Hungry Hungry Hippos, the game, is the hippos are competing against each other to eat the most marbles. It's a race. It's a marble-eating race, right? You've seen the trailer. You've seen the, the commercial for the game. I've never played the game because I wasn't rich. Sorry I couldn't afford Hungry Hungry Hippos. I was busy on my poor ass ps2 and gamecube my parents couldn't afford hungry hungry hippos we were the working class so i've never played it but i assume by the tagline about the marvel the marble eating race is that you race to eat the most goddamn marbles so what i think should actually be better 
is that we have different hippo factions. Okay, 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 new plan. The, a the Triple HCU doesn't take place on Earth. We never like it when they're like, oh, actually, it's, it takes place on Earth. Oh, look at that. Sonic is in Earth now. No, 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 no. The Triple HCU is going to take place on the hippo homeland, and the whole movie will be about different hippo factions competing for a limited number of um, resources, and it's going to be almost like a dystopian commentary on how humanity is so consumed with fighting itself for limited resources when they should just come together and instead of eating all the marbles, they should make a marble farm. All of the hippos should use their resources together to make a marble farm and then ration the marbles to everyone, no matter how hungry they are. Right? So, so like... So basically it's yeah it's going to we're going to care about these different factions of hippos there's going to be a main hippo one would call let's call him Harry Harry the hungry hippo and he is going to be our main character our kind of the audience surrogate into the world of the hungry hungry hippos and we're going to it's going to be a fantasy thing basically but then still at the end of Hungry or Hungry or Hippos or Hungry, Hungry, Hungry Hippos, haven't quite decided. I do like Hungry or Hungry or Hippos, Max. That was, that was a good pull. Then, then we will reveal a portal that was actually causing the marble deficit. The, the marble deficit in the first place is caused by a portal at the center of the Hungry Hungry Hippo world's home planet. And the portal goes to Candyland, baby! Or what would be cool is, is there another game that requires marbles that also needed the marbles? And then instead of like an Avengers type thing, it's going to be an Avengers versus X-Men. And the other... We're going to have another standalone movie in this other world, like Starving Stegosaurus prequel. What a, what other marble games are there? And who in Candyland controls the portal? Richard Vendetta? No, no, guys, focus. Give me another game, like a famous game that is marbles. I don't want to let you down, Flagon, but they're not actually marbles. They're plastic balls. Okay, you get banned for that. Mods, ban its jupy for spitting facts that I don't like. Okay, they don't need marbles. Fine, fine, fine. It's not marbles. It's Candyland. They, they, they need, they need, they need the marbles for something in Candyland. Uh, I don't like Candyland. I because like, if I'm gonna be honest, the 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 peasants of Candyland are gonna get eviscerated by the hungry hungry hippos. Like I don't think that's a fair fight. What we really want is like. To like, like what I, I don't want a Batman versus Superman situation where it's like, why doesn't Superman simply tear Batman's face off in a millisecond? Don't want that. I want to actually closer to Godzilla versus Kong, but slightly less stupid. The hungry, hungry hippo V what other game this is movie is going to take its very, it's going to take itself very seriously. So We need the biting crocodile. That's what it is. Thank you. It's going to be hippos versus crocodiles. There's going to be a biting crocodile universe, and they're going to have to fight the crocs versus the hippos. And it's going to be hippos versus crocs. And we're going to have, it's going to be, oh, which side will you choose? And you know what we're not going to do? We're not going to wuss out at the end and not pick a winner. One is going to win. Either the hippos are going to win or the crocs are going to win and there's going to be repercussions for which one won and which one lost. Our cinematic universe, our Triple H cinematic universe is not going to be stakeless for the simple fact of appeasing shareholders, okay? We're going to create actual art, meaningful, impactful, significant art that has a message and is really cool because it'll be big hippos fighting big crocodiles. The hippos are winning from the beginning. Ah, that's maybe that's what we want you to think, and maybe will be an it'll be an upset. It'll be an upset, 
and the crocodiles will kill the hippos. They'll kill the main character, the main Harry, Harry the hippo. He will die. And then we, the hungry, hungry hippos will have to find another portal and pull out the monkeys in a barrel universe. And then the monkey, well, now we're getting too close to Kong territory. I don't know. I really don't want this to be unoriginal. You know, I want this to have, I want this to have novelty. And so we've already seen monkeys fighting Godzilla. That's not much different than a monkey fighting a crocodile. So I want to stick to hippos v crocodiles v some other third thing we haven't seen fight on the big screen. I'm, I'm willing to take suggestions. Um, what was I doing? Right, we were fighting Gardevoir. Brenda. Brendy's nuts. <laughs> then Harry song Harold takes up his father's mantle and then he dies too. It's possible. It's possible. I don't hate it. I don't I don't hate it. I'm gonna be entirely honest with you. I don't hate that. I, I don't hate that suggestion, homie. But are hippos horses? Don't ask stupid questions, Gala Joe. Of course hippos are horses. What are you on? Are you on meth? Sorry, I don't know where that came from. Is that, is that inappropriate to ask somebody if they're on meth? What is... We actually got Pokerus? Yeah, no, we did. Um, who does voice acting for the hippos? Why are we, why are we getting voice actors? Uh, all right, Peppa. In a stream, no. In surgery, yes. For the meth question. <laughs> Guys, I'm going to be real. Oh, my God. So, I grew up in Arizona. And I believe Arizona has a rather large meth problem. And so, we would always, as kids, be... Sub, 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 you'd be subjected to the Arizona Meth Project commercials. And I don't think I was in danger of ever doing meth anyways, but I will tell you, those commercials are horrifying. And I, sir, will not be doing meth. So consider this a checked off, a checked off, customer or you 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 got your mark arizona meth project i those commercials are horrifying absolutely horrifying um there's one where a girl is taking a shower and then she sees her meth self in the corner of the it's terrifying i don't even know if i should be i don't even know if this goes goes like past maybe, maybe this is should there be a content warning? I don't know. I apologize if this is not appropriate, but God, those commercials are horrifying and they worked. But you know what else this reminds me of is recently I've been getting a lot of ads on YouTube about vaping and like the, the consequences of vaping. And it's like something like no, no vaping or whatever. And I can't tell you, I can't think of a single bigger waste of money than paying people to ask me to not vape because i will never vape <laughs> it's like you already got like like you're wasting your money stop trying to get me to stop vaping because i've never vaped and i'm never going to because it's incredibly stupid and um maybe i alienate some people with this but vaping is for losers so yeah so <laughs> like you I, I i encourage you to increase awareness for the consequences of vaping for children because vaping is stupid and dumb but don't you do not need to waste your money on me i'm sorry you 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 don't it's it's a massive waste of money to be like hey flag on don't vape yeah heard chef i got it i wasn't planning on it I'm going to do, if I'm going to, I'm going to do math before I vape. I'll tell you that. <laughs> Anyways. Um, 
10 months, let's go. Thanks, Getting poison is best type. Shiny fly gone. Sometimes, maybe I should keep my comments to myself. The UK is making single-use vapes illegal. Hell yeah, baby. We stopped chat from, we stopped Monty from vaping chat. Yeah, it was all you guys. Isn't the only consequence of vaping looking too cool? I don't even have a clever response to that because it was too stupid. Sometimes you just can't respond to things when they're too stupid. But I think you're being facetious. Either that or you're an idiot. <laughs> All right, let's go fight this sucker. Oh. The only thing vaping is good for is for people who are trying to wean off cigarettes. But if you started vaping without having originally smoked, then you are stupid or you are a child or more realistically, you are a stupid child. So. Yeah. It was pretty cool. We almost beat smoking in, we almost beat smoking in the US. Is the goat chai mecho still kicking? You freaking know it, baby. <coughs> Huh. Flygon, we love you and don't want to see you hurt. Stop <laughs> you vaping meth. <coughs> <coughs> I'll try, buddy. Oh, crap. <coughs> Night waper. Night. La la la. Night waver. Thank you so much for the sub. Flygon trying to vape that water. <coughs> yeah, you know it, baby. Um, this is not who it was supposed to come out. Why do you lie to me, Calc? Why, Calc? Why lie? Why lie to me, Calc? You dumb... Dummy. What is your move? What is your item? Oh, wise glasses, right. Mm, we got a wise guy here. Speaking of lungs, how was your alum run? Oh, the alum run was grand, except that um, I'm still suffering the consequences of my actions. I was not really prepared for it, but I did run 455. So I was really happy because the goal was to break five. And I did. But um, yeah, my lungs and my legs are still pretty sore. Still pretty sore from that. Eggs. Get your eggs. Oh, he was like, I'm sick and tired of this bounce stuff. I see the writing on the wall. <coughs> All right, well, Low Pony is dead. I hope. Yeah, okay. And then Medicham. You know what? We're just going to stay in and let Groot handle this. Ugh. So what? We talked about... Max just showed me his Flygon HG impression. It was spot on, not going to lie. <laughs> here, 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 here. Let me do it. What? That... I got to quit? Oh, oh, now I'm upset. Ugh. That, that's my flag on each team present. Uh, hmm. Well, energy ball. Here's my flag on HG impression. Ready? Wait, what did it do? What did it do? It acupressured? What did it, what happened? Well, I'm too scared to find out. So Hunch Crow, you come in. Seven out of 10 needs to be saltier. How's that? Was that saltier? Here's my flag on HG impression. <clears throat> Seven out of ten. 
sounded more like Garchomp FJ. No, this is Garchomp FJ. Huh? I came up with this a while ago, and people seem to respond positively to it, but now I'm not sure where I'm really going with it. Oh! Um, where... All right, so we got these... Galactic Grunts. Oh, I'm I'm deeply worried that this is actually kind of annoying. That's my Garchomp FJ impression. Golbat and Perugly against the Galactic Drunts. You can't have a Perugly. You're not Jupiter. I mean, Mars. Oh, they're only level 46, though. Homie can't do sh tiddly shit. Tiddly winks. Golbat, Houndoom, Muck, Perugly, Toxicroak, Skuntank. Ugh. This is kind of ass, my guy. My team's not particularly good for this, if I'm being honest. It's quite poor, actually. Zygarde EK when? Will H didn't watch the most recent video. Way to tattle on yourself, Will H. Not a true fan. <laughs> Mawile! 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 Uh, yeah, we gotta, we gotta actually get out of here. Gotta skedaddle. You think Garchomp, FJ, and Richard are in cahoots with Maxi's Serene Grace camera up? Oh, yeah, that guy. What a wanker that guy was. Where is my escape rope? Tommy's always dragging me down. I'm always saying Riley, dead weight. Uh, okay, well, let's just go get Poliwrath. I'm sure Poliwrath does gangbusters into these baddies. Although, actually, there is a, a Golbat, so what do I know? Ooh, what if we run into this lady on the way out? I think it might behoove me to actually just take out this homie while we have the chance, you know? Yeah, we'll just fight her real quick. Why not? Get over here. <clears throat> you know, I may be anti-vaping, but I have gambling points as my vice. Yeah. Big mistake there, Grovile. You gonna get the double? Nope, not even gonna try. Game coward. You're a goddamn coward. And you're an old man and a fool!
Hack HG equals hack guy, then FJ equals fierce janitor. Your logic is impeccable. So FJ stands for force jawed. Yep. Garchomp FJ, huh. The greatest trick the devil ever pulled is convincing you he didn't, I'm having a stroke. What, um, you know what? Just, just keep going, Moondragon. You got this queen. Like, whatever. You're not flying type, so this is nothing. That's a crit. You take an edible at any point today? Nar. Did an edible take you at any point today? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> ah, hacks will not save you now, right you? Why is Raichu's tail cut off? Do you see that? Guys, hold the phone. Raichu has a cut tail here. Somebody nicked his tail. Does Raichu always look like that? A female Raichu? Some circumcised Raichu, it appears. Jesus. That's not, that's not, that doesn't happen. That doesn't happen to female Raichus. Jesus. I've never... Is that true? Is that true? All Raichus get clopped like that? That's horrible. That's stupid. What up, Clefable Table? We were just talking about you, actually. Can't be a girl, right? True girls are a government lie. That's true. Girls are just a invention of the liberal agenda designed to make men look stupid. And it's working. Wait a minute. Oh, right, 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 right. Sounds like you were talking about circumcision, but go off, I guess. I've literally never said the word circumcision in my life. Stop. Stop putting words in my mouth, especially words, icky words like circumcision. Thoughts on the tortured poets department? <laughs> Finally. Well, here's here's my thoughts on Taylor Swift's newest announced album. I think I think that the name Tortured Poets Society is kind of stupid. But but Dana, my better half, the smart one in the family, has a theory that it's stupid on purpose. Now I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. Stupid on purpose is stupid. No. No. Not in this case. Some cases, yes. Oh, the point of Glass Onion is that it's stupid. Well, it's still stupid. This, though, is a statement. And my guess is that Tortured Poet Society is about her dumb exes. Well, not my, my, not my theory. I agree with Dana's theory. She, it's, it's tongue in cheek. And it's making fun of emo, like self-serious boys that she's dated in the past. And I am willing to put 
all cards on the table. Put it all in on that. If it's not that, then it's a really stupid name for an album. But Taylor... You can say a lot of things about Taylor Swift. You can say that she uses her jet too much. You can say that she's apolitical to a fault sometimes. But you can't say that she's dumb. She's very, very intelligent. And she knows exactly what she's doing. Hence, I think, I think, I think, we're being rused. Thoughts, Clefable Table? Ms. Swift is a millennial, so cringe is in the nature. Hey, 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 hey. I'm a millennial. <laughs> and are you saying that I'm cringe? So... Right. What a spout. I ask anyone I'm not cringe. I'm base. I'm base, baby. I'm beset. That's a cool word that the hip, cool kids are saying. Man, I was just walking down the street the other day, and this cool cat, he came up to me and said, See that guy over there? He's based. And then took a spritz from his inhaler, tripped on his tied shoelaces, and broke his front tooth. Then he went and then he went to the hospital and stuff. I'm just babbling. I don't know how to deal with this fight. Like, is do I just pick a Pokemon and go for it, you know? I'll wait for your Gen Zers apology when you need help printing again. Uh oh. <laughs> As a member of Gen Z, you are lucky it's flag on HG and not HC because we all know it would stand for hella cringe. <laughs> Got him. What a punk. Oh, man. You showed me. Um, what does Grumpig... How does Grumpig do here? You know what? Sure. I don't fucking like... Whatever. Rum pig go goddamn nuts. I don't I don't know, you know. This little grum piggy went to the market. This little grum piggy killed your family. Uh, yeah, whatever. We'll take grum pig. Look at me, icon of innovation, icon of reeds. What's that? I don't understand what's happening anymore. And I'm a little scared. Um, I just need a big beefy beefcake. That's all I need. But not that one, because that one's too... Nope. Can I whisk cash you a question? Oh my god, I've already made that pun. I'm old and confused and it's making me angry. The hungry hungry hippos are recovering from vape, addi vape addiction. Guys, I feel like I've lost control of chat. <laughs> RIP chat. Think? Do you think when God looks down on what he's created, he weeps? Perugly. Uh... 
Alright, we're bringing our Maldo and calling it a day. I don't even care. Uh, that wasn't the right quote, Clefable Table. The correct quote was, Do you think God hides in heaven because he too fears what he's created? And that's just about the hardest line anyone's ever come up with. And it's in freaking Spy Kids. <laughs> That's from Spy Kids. Freaking know it, baby. Think I'd make that up? Like some sort of fake liar? Like like some sort of freaking freaking liar liar man? I don't lie. The only thing I do is shed light on the truth. As they said in Fairly Odd Parents, Channel Chasers, the truth will set you free. Um, yeah, you know what? Whatever. This is fine. What even? <laughs> sure. Exeg her tour. I hardly know her tour. Yep. It, yep. Um, Houndoom. What what is good against Houndoom and Toxicroak? The one-two punch of Houndoom Toxicroak. Is it this fella? Yeah, I think that's alright. I mean, not really, but whatever. What is going on, by the way? I don't know. I don't know. It's a weird day, you know? I think we need to level set chat a little bit. Pull up the couch sheet for half an hour or so. Why is there more than four people in chat? Should I drive some of them away with my math? This is such a good and clever line. It does not deserve a movie like Spy Kids. You mean the, do you think that God hides in heaven because he too is afraid of what he has created? So want to know a funny story? Very early into me and Dana's relationship, um, we talked about that quote and how, like I'm saying now, it's really ill and it's from a Spy Kids movie. She, she thinks it's a really funny quote for it being in Spy Kids. So... It's one of the first things that we, we bonded over is this random ass Spy Kids quote. We're very cool people. You're lucky to, to know us. And so one time when we were still in the texting phase of our relationship where like we weren't, you know, we weren't living together and we weren't seeing each other every day, but we were texting each other quite a lot is I thought that it would be funny to send her texts in order where the first word of each text was sequentially that phrase. So my first text started with do, and then my second text started with you, and then my third text started with think. And she was texting me back as I was doing this whole thing, and I had to like come up with ways to text, or to, to make each of my texts start with those words in subsequent <laughs> order. <laughs> She doesn't deserve me. No, that's true. She deserves much better, but <laughs> I'm lucky. Um, and it worked. I did it. And then afterwards, I was like, check the messages. And she was like, you suck. It was pretty fun. Slightly psychotic, I will admit, but it was fun. Um, ba ba bum. She didn't pick up on it on her own, did she? Nope. Nope. 
I had to tell her, I had to be like, go back and look at all of these messages. It's because I made up some like fake story. I was, I was, it was like about my dad's cat. <laughs> and how she was being annoying or something. Uh, where's my choice scarf? Can Grumpig learn D-Gleam? Can Grumpy learn the Gleam? Who the hell has my Choice Scarf? Alright, it's Haunch Pro. Very curious how far you can bring this run. Me too, bestie. Me too. Bringing it all the way, baby. All the way. Hoorah! All right! Hoorah, my man! Oh, crap. Let's hope so. That's a very ominous thing to say. Why would you say that? Hey, Cliff Able Table. You want to be useless for once? I want to make a prediction for Deathless uh, Byron. Yeah, I didn't think so. Does anybody want to be a mod? Your first job will be to ban Clefable Table, and then your second will be to make this prediction. Nublike, thank you so much for the 15 months. It's Creeps. I also missed you from four months a while ago. Thank you so much. I volunteer as Tribute. Do I have any qualifications? No. Damn. Wait, Clefable, did you do a full 30 minutes? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I can only backseat mod. Ah, spoken like a true chatter. I love the awareness. Awareness is the first step. I can be a mod, but I am fish biased. I'll consider it. I'll consider it. Oh, I was like, wait, we already fought them? That's right. We're gonna fight these homies. It's Tuesday, isn't it? Oh, thank God, an actual mod. Oh, oh. You don't know how awful it was being stuck with Clefable Table, Evoli. It was like watching a child try to put a rectangle squared thing into a circular hole. All right, step one, kill that homie. Um, then what? I don't know. Profit, maybe? I asked what's happening and you said nothing. It's chill. Uh, again, putting words in my mouth. Classic Clefable table. Um, just, oh my God, you idiot. Are you dense? Oh, I killed. Okay, never mind. Sorry. I underestimated your game, Lucario. Carry on, homie. Carry on. Carry on my way. Blah, 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 blah. Um, ooh, an Intimidate. All right, Skuntank's got Flamethrower Crunch and Sluge Boom. And Hound Doom as what? Flamethrower, Dark Pulse, Embargo, and Nasty Plot. Well, that's a little scary. Let's hope that this works out okay.
Holy shit, Lucario. Okay. Good job, Spider Ham. The greatest to ever do it. I say, I say, I say. All right, the Toxic Croakster. Oh, wait, no, this is a muck that comes out. Ooh, I'm not a huge fan of that. Wait, 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 Gunshot does 39 to 47 percent. How much does it do to Skun Tank? The incident? The hell are you talking about? What incident? Whatever it is, I've clearly gotten over it. So by the transitive property, you probably should have two. I feel like homie Relican eats these for breakfast, lunch, and dinny. Ooh, kind of wish I had earthquake still, huh? Eh, well, what are you going to do? Acting like you didn't even know. Good job, Lucario! Yay, Lucario! Holy crap, was that a crit? No? Mamma mia, Santa Mozzarella! That was a minus one high jump kick? Just did, what, 90% to Skun Tank? Gee willikers! G Willikers. Oh, he brings out another Pokemon. Okay, we're 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 Gooch. Um, Metagross. You have Earthquake. Please don't have Earthquake. Ah, crap. Um. All right. I mean. I mean, surely he doesn't Earthquake me, right? Well, let's let's make sure. Woo! Okay. Double battles do be my weakness. He's got a Salamence after this, too. Sick! All right, all right, Toxic Croak. Um, maybe, maybe don't, maybe don't do the, the old Meteor Mash thing, okay? I mean, don't, you know, don't. What, uh, what does Toxic Croak know? You got Zen Headbutt, so assuredly you, assuredly... I am, and don't call me Shirley. Well, this has Drain Punch and Sucker Punch. So I should probably go to like, I don't know, Spider Ham. I don't know, freaking. All right, Metagross, you gonna do the heavy work for me? You ain't gotta go to work. Work, work, work. Let my body do the work. Work, work. We can work from home. Oh, oh. We can work from home. Oh, oh. We ain't gotta go to work. Work, work.
Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, gunk shot now just kills me. So uh, maybe we go back to Omla Juggernaut. Good job, Meta Gross. Good job, Meta Gross. Good job, Meta Gross. Good job. Can I get a round of applause for being sick and still having moved a table? Not a clefable one, Sag. Chairs, a couch, into my new apartment today. As well as cleaning. Congrats, that's awesome. Proud of you. Right, just keep just keep doing the work, Meta Gross. Mati, do you only listen to pop, country pop, etc., or other stuff as well? Just that. Just that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I regret to inform. All right. Well, I think we can all agree that both Riley and I contributed equally to this fight. And that's the great thing about a partnership is that we both did it together. Hey, Olivia Rodrigo is swell, and you know it. You know it. Have I considered doing a monkey lock? No, I haven't, but maybe I will. Think about all the monkeys. There's Mankey and Chimpchar and Oranguru. Oh my god, guys, we need to do a monkey tier list stat. Maybe I'd watch that. Well, damn, with that type of guaranteed return on investment, should just do it right now. Metal coat. Can you use apes in a monkey lock? Apes together. Strong. Yeah, I don't know. Sure. Byron, your son misses you. Is Darmanitan a monkey? Yeah. We'll do it's a monkey lock with apes. Darmanitan's definitely a monkey. He's gorilla. Also the Unovan monkeys, very true, very true. What other monkeys are there? Let's uh I don't know. I don't want to do primate lock because then humans are primates. So the hell do we do about Hitmonchan, you know? Ambipom. Ambipom's a monkey. Grookey's a monkey. Yup. Yup. Lots of monkeys. Pussimian. Another fire monkey. Slacking is a sloth, I think. I don't know if I would allow that in the monkey lock. What are sloths, actually? Hold up. Just now realizing, are sloths monkeys? They're related to armadillos and anteaters. Those little freaks. They're in the order Pylosa. 
Like pile of swine? What about Electivire? Uh, I don't think so. Sloths are long-nailed sleepy humans. That's horrifying. I don't, I don't appreciate you subjecting me to that imagery. Okay, so it feels like I can just kill literally everything here with Magmortar. I'm gonna do that. I'm a big fish. Yummy, yummy, yummy. I get in my tummy, tummy, tummy. When I open my mouth, some krill. Big fish. Big fish. Yummy, yummy in my tummy. Um, okay. What is Chespin? Isn't Chespin a chipmunk? of some sort that evolves into a Digimon looking homie. tub and thrash. According to Google, it's a lemur and lemurs are primates. Wait, what's a lemur? I kind of forgot that lemurs count. Which Pokemon is a lemur? Enlighten me. Chespin was porcupines? I guess that kind of makes sense. They include slacking? Yeah, but like What about slack can you can you can you justify including slack off? King Julian Me and my JJ will laugh and will play eh. Oh Grafaya? Yeah, Grafaya is definitely a monkey. Well, we're not doing this playthrough in Scarlet and Violet. I value my time. Never again will I do a playthrough in Scarlet and Violet. You sickos making me play that game. Oh, Flagon, I'm kind of disappointed that you didn't go and do all the six million additional fights at the very end of the game. <laughs> Maybe you can't use slaking until it's fully evolved. Yeah. Might work. The issue with all of the, like, animal locks is the damn gnat decks of it all. You know? It's a big bummer. To be fair, I think Area Zero Prof is the real final boss. Cool! You know what's not cool? Sitting through an hour of text to get to the final boss that- Oh! Look! Oh! You just beat it super easily, literally never lost a Pokemon to her.
Turns out that actually planning for one specific trainer is not nearly as hard as training and planning for five trainers. So going from the Elite Four to some random ass trainer is incredibly underwhelming. I do agree though that the music is sick. I'll give him that. Ew, Empoleon. Uh-oh, glad I checked that. Empoleon, Scizor, and Metagross? What are we doing? Oh, another Metagross? In your opinion, is the text dialogue the biggest issue with Scarlet and Violet? Yeah, the cutscenes are a nightmare. They genuinely make me not want to play the game. Like, even just sitting there and holding an auto-fire button, it's like, it's such a fucking waste of time, which is so cool, because, or, which is so frustrating, because some of that game is really cool. Um, do I have to do better here? Can I not- can I not deal with this? I can with Polly. No, it's got Grass Knot. Dude, this- this Pokemon... Low-key? Pokemon's pretty messed up, bro. Um, how did I deal with the last Empoleon? Does anybody remember? Which is worse on cutscenes, SV and Usum? I mean, probably Usum. But I actually don't even know if that's true now that I think about it. And the thing with Usum is that Citra runs faster than Ryu Jinx. Oh, sorry. I don't know who said that. Um, <clears throat> that was weird. Was that Subby or something? Rivals and Polion was Manetric. That's right. Okay, let's try that. Ah, uh, but we needed, like, a switch, right? Even at 52, does Thunderbolt with choice specs kill? No. Oh. Oh, Manetric, you're so bad. Oh, Manetric, you're so bad. You're so bad. You blow my mind. Hey, Manetric, you suck, suck. Hey, Manetric. Manetric is already 53. Well, let's check 53. It is minus spadef nature, so you'd think it would kill. Oh, it does kill. Nice. Okay, word. Cool. Manetric. Oh, Manetric, you suck so much. You suck so much. You blow my mind. Hey, Manetric. Hey, hey, Manetric. Oh, Manetric, you suck so much. You suck so much. You blow my mind. Hey, Manetric. Hey, 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 Manetric. Oh, Manetric. Okay, so, um... Man, if we didn't have to have choice specs, this would be phenomenal. So. Choice specs. Kill that. Scizor comes in. It's going to want to use X scissors. Oh, well, this is just peachy. Because then we can just go into him and profit, right? Oh my god, that is a lot of damage. 35 to 42%? Are you kidding me? At two, Brute? Oof. Um, if we get crit... Nah, I'd need to double crit. I'm risking it.
Black and white too have five monkeys if you include Slay King. The problem is I think you can only get one of the three shit monkeys. No, you can get you can get all of them. Can't kill the Metagross in one shot with Maggie. <laughs> Safe Luma's chat was held because of bullying. Imagine calling somebody a shit monkey. That's that's kind of a very mean <laughs> thing to call someone. Shout out to Maximo, who created Maximum Platinum, a ROM hack of Platinum where every single trainer in the game has a custom-made team made by the trainer they're named after. Spoiler, Flag on HG is a certain gym leader. Yes. But which one? You'll never know. <laughs> um, <coughs> Dude, having this ace trainer have a Metagross is rude, to say the least. Experto, experto patrona. Experto patrona. Oh, wait, we need an expert belt. What am I doing? Experto patrona. Okay. Okay. Great. Now, what happens if homie dies here? Then we need a contingency plananas. It's gonna be rapid ass with a choice band. Yep. All right, where's Honduras or whatever his name is? This guy, Houndoom. Um, yikes. Uh, I don't know why Altaria is here, if I'm being entirely honest. Yeah, okay, whatever. BRB, just go get a kappa. A kappa what? The three horsemen of the apocalypse. Okay. Um, cough, cough, grr, slurp, slurp. Um, you know. Byron is a chump. I've decided. Oh, right. That's what I was going to do. Whale Lord, buddy. Why don't you hold on to my XP share for me? 
Ah, uh, chief. You suck up that XP like the big chunky whale you are. All right, this guy. I can't believe you can just, like, wipe to this fella here. That is horrifying. I hate this guy. Ace Trainer Cesar. Somebody overcooked this team, I gotta say. Oh. We're fine. All right. Um, let's make this a little. Let's let's make this easy, yeah. No crit. 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 Okay, we're good. Now we simply. This gun is on fire. This gun is on fire. She's working on fire. This gun is on fire. Oh, someone please help. She's burning on down. She is on fire. Oh, um, one help. Please, you have to save her life. This girl is on fire. This girl is on fire. She's literally on fire. This girl is on fire. Seriously, guys, she's on fire. Um, that's how you beat a mag mortar. Just kidding. I have a mag mortar. That's how you beat this guy with that. It's, it's just, it's just. All right. Is it this way or this way? Uh, it's this way, isn't it? All right, worker... Jackson? Fuck, dude, I fucked up. Now, now this guy's at... Uh, whatever. Where's my choice specs? Well, crap, that's that's the wrong trainer. Okay, um, mm-hmm. All right, well. Stone Edge, Zap Cannon, and Lock On, eh? Theoretically, it should just head smash here. Use the kill, although it is at minus one. Still always just see the kill. So we should be able to go nebula.
OK. So allegedly, this should never, right? They don't explode on their first. I'm going to explode if they're the last Pokemon, so we can just go back to Doom over here. One would think. Although, perhaps I should not risk Hound Doom and instead risk Rapidash just in case it does go kablooey. Rather not risk it, you know? Although, then again, it could go Drill Run here. Wait, if it goes Drill Run, probably shouldn't do that either. And Drill Run just kills this homie. Do I stay in with Polyrath? Namor? Do I go to Namor? Kinda <laughs> kinda screwed up here. What up, Gongus? Look at the Caterpie and the Weedle making out. Hey, check your horniness at the door, shockingly, Gongus. We are a PG chat. This is a PG stream, Gongus. You sicko. What, um, now what? I made it. Oh, oh, oh. Lucario, huh? Wrong Lucario. Lucario, huh? Black Belt David? Boy. Okay. All right, so here's the thing. How Doom does not outspeed this. Some disgustingly offensive reason. It also does not one shot it. I think we have to go rapid ass. All right, rapid ass. You ready? You ready to be an utter cutie? My God, you're not faster either, rapid ass. You are at 52. I remember that this exists. Knock it off. Can't you see? He's it's hurting him. Blah, blah, blah. Ooh, double kick. Why do these do so little damage? Just rapid ash is balls. Truly a Pokemon of all time. All right, Ace Trainer Brianna with Skarmory, Mawile, and Wormadame. <laughs> when, not if, you beat Cynthia, do you think you'll do the post-game bosses? Um, I can promise you, I will absolutely not be doing that.
Bum, 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 bum. I'm an Etric. Time to see if you've really got what it takes to be a Pokemon master. See if you have the skills to be no- Ooh, never mind, we'll use you. We all live in a Pokemon world, Pokemon. I wanna be the greatest master of them all. We all live in a Pokemon world, Pokemon. I wanna be the greatest master of them all, Pokemon. We all live in a Pokemon world. I don't know if this is gonna get buried, but hi. Dr. HG, I recently got into your content and I love it. First time I've tuned into a stream, so I wish you great luck and no unfortunate crits. Thanks so much, Echo Bows. Much appreciated. What an absolutely wholesome chat. Really much appreciated. Thank you so much. Oh, and you gave out a gifted community sub. That's so generous. You didn't have to do that, but thank you. I see you. So someone in your Discord gave me cotton candy and it sent me to an unknown reality which was my bedroom but weird. First warning, buddy. You're gonna be a weirdo. I'm gonna start ignoring you. First warning. First warning. A wholesome chat message without a punchline. My subversions have been expected. What? <laughs> Too wholesome, someone ruin it. No. Wholesome, good. Weirdos, not good. Because my expectations have been subverted. I just noticed Houndoom is using Flamethrower from her eyes. She got the heat vision, Agatha. We love weirdos here. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's the wrong pronoun there, just Zezek. All right, um... I guess it depends on the type of weirdo. You know? Certain weirdos are fine. Others, though? Wholesome, plus having fun, plus great content, plus silly in nature. There's a limit to the weirdos. Certified silly weirdos, yeah. <laughs> you have to be a silly weirdo, not a weird weirdo. I guess there's silly weirdos and then there's creepy weirdos. The opposite of a ratio is just another ratio, isn't it? You're either a, a silly weirdo or a creepy weirdo, and you really have to hope that you're more silly than weird, you know? It is a spectrum. All right. We've officially gotten to Byron, who is often secretly one of the hardest trainers in the game because I always deeply underestimate his weenie ass. But he leaves with Bronzong, so that seems like a pretty easy way to set the hell up. I mean, well, all right, let's, let's check it. Bronzong, 
He's got Bronzong uh, with Light Clay and Reflect and shit, which is fine. We'll just teach Brick Bark. Blah, blah, blah. We'll just teach Brick Break to Mag Mortar, and then I'm pretty sure Mag Mortar can just literally kill every single one of these Pokemon, but let's test it. Um, Bronzong with Light Clay, Magnezone with Wise Glasses, Steelix with Muscle Band, Fortress with Citrus Berry, Agron with Focus Sash, and Bastiodon with Leftovers. It is sassy in nature. So let's see. Uh, let's let's quickly see. I believe that Magmordar is our strongest special attacker. Yeah. So like if we do 52... Yeah. So let's say we do Expert Belt. We kill that. Uh, actually, we're going to be 53. We kill Steelix. And we also know Aura Sphere. And theoretically, we can learn Brick Break. Brick Break, Flamethrower, Aura Sphere, Rock Tombi. Flamethrower kills Steelix. Aura Sphere kills Agron if we set up Stealth Rock to ensure that that doesn't blah blah blah. Flamethrower kills you. Aura Sphere does not kill you with Expert Belt. Um, but. We could life orb, but then we're running the risk. Ugh. All right, let's figure it out. What if we're at fifty four? At fifty four with stealth rock, though. 25% chance. Me. Me. Oh, we can just Will O Wisp this homie, yeah? Aura Sphere, Flamethrower, Brick Break, and Will O Wisp. Um, if it toxics us, then we simply go out to Rapid Ass or Hound Doom. My God, Hound Doom, you're not good. You're not very good. Goalie, goalie, you suck. Oh, wait, um, does Polyrath learn close combat at 53? I think you do, right? <laughs> All right, so uh, now let's re reevaluate. Damn, Daniel. Whoops. Okay, well, that's how we do that then. Great. Two-band show.
Figured it out. I'm the greatest detective. Gotta get a stealth rock setter upper. So he's a bit of a setter upper. He's got a few flaws. Uh, sand slash probably does does the job. Yeah, and then we can get yawn on um Chimeco. Oh, Byron, you hapless fool. Sand Woman is back. She's back, baby. It's the changing of the seasons. All right. Now what? Um, get everybody to 53, I suppose. Yeah, <laughs> fissure. In the season of the sticks and the mama forgot that she existed in the alcohol. Now we scatch you question. Two weeks from now? Don't forget two weeks from now is what? What? <coughs> March is certified brunch season? Really? For the love of God, would you stop singing? You know? There was once another man who was asked to stop doing something. Do you know what his name was? That's right. Jesus Christ. What is this name? What do we what if I what if I, what if I, yeah, that's good. Ah! 
Alright, let's get her done. We are never, ever, ever gonna stop singing. We. Yo, wait. Michael Buble? Oh, right, Will O Wisp is the other thing we were going to teach this homie. Will O Wisp, 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 Will O Wisp. We do not have the TM for Will O Wisp. Son of a nutcracker. We don't have it. We don't have it. Mayday. Mayday, 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 Mayday. Oh, no. Saw your mom. She forgot that I existed. Guys, I hate when I see people from my past's mom and they forget that I've existed. Gotta be so embarrassing. It's so embarrassing. It's like, oh, hello. Hello, hello, Mrs. Wagner. Did you forget me? You did. I guess I must not have left a lasting impact to your storied life. Must suck, moms never forget me. I was that kid they always said was the good influence. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, you toot that horn, fat white duke. You know what they say? Quiet fat white dukes never make history. What? You got yawn? Okay, brick break, blah bitty blah, bleebity blah, blue bitty blah, blebity blah, and blah bitty bloop. Okay, we're good to go. Saw Magmortar, she forgot that I existed, and I uh, drink alcohol until my friends come home for distance and they. Alcohol until my friends go home and alcohol. All right, adventure as the kiddos say is out there. Got rapid spin and stealth rock. Good, good man, good man. All right. Who's ready? Chat, are we ready? It's another Chimeco sweep. Where's JP when you need him? Probably off making sick content like a loser. Probably off making interesting and unique content. Go subscribe to JP's total, total nerd, that guy. Out there being creative and shit. Nerd. Hashtag... JP's a nerd. Hashtag subscribe to the nerd. Hashtag follow. Hashtag give him give him some love. Probably out pursuing his dream, loser. <laughs> Alright. Oh man, he just he's just, he's just right into it. I didn't even have time to, to read what he said. Alright, PJ. JP's JP sir. This one's for JP. We're gonna sweep this whole ass team with Chimeco. Chimeco's job is done. 
Beyond them. So that's a blight screen. Fine. You know why? Because homie's asleep. So now, on the guaranteed turn of sleep, we set up stealth rocks. Love it. Now we switch to torch. Break, break. Break them screens, baby. It shattered the barrier. Stealth rock, that's fine. Um, all right, the one way this goes a little saucy. Nah, I just can't do math for some reason. That's 12%. Yeah, no, we're good. Flamethrowers kills this. All right, word. Now... Now we profit off of our best laid plans. Steelix comes in all wriggly and stuff. Yeah, look at him wriggle. Okay. Sure. Okay. Agron cometh out. We have broken Agron's focus sash here with our pointed stones. Now we are asleep. Make sure that kills. I'd be stunned if it didn't. I'm because I'm pretty sure I did the calc. Yep. Okay. That almost kills it twice over. Cool. Okay. Sure. Next up, Fortress. Okay. That was a lot of HP. I mean, XP, huh? All right, Fortress, I regret to inform you that you do not take this flamethrower particularly well. Roughly 278.7% to 327.7%. So, um, yeah, that's that. Great. Okay. Next up is Bastion Dawn. Sebastian Dawn. Young Bastiodon weekends on CBS. So, um, we unfortunately don't get the kill here. So we're going to have to wow this. And we're going to miss. So that's, as the kids say, annoying. But, fine. We'll do that. We'll do it this way. We'll go to our three attack IV Nebula. Oh, protect. How about you get fucked, Bastiodon? <laughs> um, great. Cool. And Magnezone, be a shame if we outsped this. one shot it 
So, um, well, that's that. That's Byron defeated. He's kind of a punk. Great. Um, as you can tell, I'm absolutely ecstatic about this news. Um, few. <laughs> can somebody do exclamation mark level caps for me, please? Thank you. 56. Oh my god, someone's a little stingy with the level cap here. That's nothing. Uh, now we have to fight Saturn again and all that crap. Uh-oh, someone's poisoned. Who is it? Shambolic day for the doubters, indeed. No, we're not doing... We're not gonna do the seventh gym leader today. There's a lot you have to do before the 7th gym leader. There's like three fights. Time for a history lesson. What's her name again? Oh, good one. Ooh. It's cute. Ooh. Candy. Ooh. Doom. What kind of library has a TV? It's like a wagon shop having a car. All right, so we gotta go now and fight Saturn. Is that right? Heaven have mercy. Um, Commander Saturn has an Alakazam, an Octillery, a Bronzong, a Rhydon, and a Toxicroak. Alakazam, huh? Alright, well, we're gonna kill that with Sucker Punch on something. Calm Mind, Psychic, Recover, and Focus Blast! Uh... I got right on it. What um ba da 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 be da dee da be da be da be da be da dum dum bum 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 all right Folks, dare I say, it's a Luminion game. It's a freaking Luminion game, baby. No, not really. Don't be stupid, Flygon. It's not a Luminion game because we have freaking Polyrath. Wow, what? Oh, we can just teach it Surf. All right. Drano gave all the good steel types to Riley and left none for Byron. Yeah, pretty much. All right, so... Alakazam Daddy. Yo? Nah. Nah. We go Crow. Because Crow guarantees the Stone Edge. Just free into Polly. So, Murkrow. Folks, we got this down to a science. Um, and then Polly. Or Whiskash. Could be Whiskash, I suppose. You know, let Whiskash have some fun. Whiskash, where even are you here? Are you even faster? Honestly, no. You're not. 
Oh, wait, yeah, you are. What am I talking about? And also, you'll be at 53. So, Water Pulse or Surf or whatever will kill. So, this could, could bring in Octillery to guarantee the Seed Bomb. Guaranteed Seed Bomb lets me go to Shiftry. It's Whiskash, baby. Fake out plus life, leaf blade, baby. You don't need a life orb. We can just do expert belt probably if we're at 53. Yeah, shiftry time. All right, Whiskash it is. Can I Whiskash you a question? Um, and then shiftry. This is suction cups, not sniper. Okay, I buy that. Bet. This stupid horse out of here. Okay, and then what? Does Moon Dragon not just wall Alakazam? Why would I try to wall Alakazam when I could simply kill it immediately? Vulture, great. Um, and then Toxicroak comes out. Croak, croak, croak. Gunk Shot and Cross Chop. A bit scary, but we do have a ghost type. But does Bayonet just go down to Gunk Shot? Oh my god. Uh, uh. Shit. So a pure poison type, which we simply don't, we just straight up don't have a pure poison type, but that's what walls both of that. Gunk shot and cross chop. Is there anything else that is immune to both? Resist both. Ta our Toxicroak resists that, I suppose. But not really. <laughs> Fuck me, man. Um, oh, brother, this guy stinks. Do I have to do something that's not shiftry? I don't even think. We had speed with you. But you're not strong enough. Oh, wait, wait. With energy ball, you might be. Why does every Pokemon I own suck? Oh, well, I mean, all of these Pokemon are stronger. I mean, faster. So, like, this will kill. Yeah. Yeah, okay, sorry, Shiftry. Not your time, I guess. All right. Exeggutor, I guess. Um... So then that guarantees Gunk Shot and or Sucker Punch, which gives us a safe switch into a Steel type, damn it. Then what, though? Uh, we could stall this out with... 
Robo Pass. And uh, Bane it. I would love to simply go into the pig and annihilate. Sadly, we cannot do that. Uh, book. Okay. Uh, hmm. What about a Pokemon that can learn Psychic but is not Psychic type? Like I don't know, Jigglypuff. Yeah, it doesn't work here, but it could. Does Magmortar learn Psychic? Should. But Homie's not gonna be faster. None of these Pokemon learn Psychic. Does Mothim learn Psychic? Mothim can learn Psychic, right? Right? Ooh, what you want, what you want? Oh, it already knows Psychic. Oh my god, but Mothim is not faster. K tragedy. It is un tradede. 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 Tragede. What you did? Also, Sucker Punch, holy hell. Hey, toi, you You know what, Motham? You know what, buddy? I believe in you. QED. You got this, homie. All right, how does one deal with Bronzong here? Homie Zong. Iron Head, Zen Headbutt, Explosion. Is this the one with Bright Powder? This is almost fucked me before, right? Yeah, Bright Powder. But at least it's last. <laughs> so I can't explode. We need a normal steel type. Does that even exist? No. Zadat gum means. Uh, well, um, Houndoom resists all of these moves. Yeah, okay. Zadat gum. Can't he also learn faint attack? So. Get. Is it that gum means? Can Luminion learn Psychic? Yo, you know how sick it would be if Luminion could learn Psychic? Except that it can't really come in on anything. It can't come in on Gunshot and it can't get in on Cross Drop. So Luminion kind of quite fucked. Um... You know what could be fun is simply just using Psychic to kill this. But I don't think we're even faster with a Choice Specs, huh? Or a Choice Scarf, huh? Sucker Punch. Ooh, we are. We are. We are. We are. We are. We are. So, this is good. I don't know. This is quite the squad we got here. What's Whiskash for again? Right, the poison. The poison for Cusco. Cusco's poison. Wait. Wait a minute. Doesn't Whiskash just take this sucker out? 
Hold the phone. I mean, no, it doesn't. Not even close. Don't know where you guys got that brilliant idea. <laughs> it's okay. Trust the Mothim. Head smash? Hardly know her. Eh. Oh my god, hurricane? Sure, why not? I don't know. Sounds fun. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Isn't Whiskash an instrument? What the hell are you talking about? Focus Sash on you. I've learned that Glaceon Ooh, Glaceon. I do like Glaceon, but I don't think Glaceon can come in and she's not fast enough. Glaceon has tragically become a bit outclassed. Yeah, it doesn't come in on cross chop or fake out. I mean, or gunk shot. So, um, we no longer have access to drill peck. That sucks. Okay. Well. All right. Well, whatever. Um, what is this homie's deal? He comes in on the right and then we kill with the yes. All right. Normal type, 100 though, nice. Whiskash. Whiskash. Ha -dee -dee -da. Whiskash joins the battle. Um. Where's my super suit? Uh, I guess we have to come this way anyways, huh? So we can just stay here. 
What? Who had my choice scarf? Does anybody remember? Ah, oh, crap. Ah, oh, crap. Crap on a stick. Spider ham. Okay. My theme. I think my theme, we simply... Folks, I'm not gonna lie to ya. This Motham... Not really the best answer to this Toxicroak. I'm gonna... I, I'm, I'm being honest. I'm being honest. Not the world's best answer... to this Toxicroak. But, you know what they say. You let a Moth dream, it'll do incredible things. You know who can learn Psychic is Honchcrow. I'm almost certain of it. Where's Bug Buzz? There it is. What else can you learn? Absolutely nothing. Hell yeah, brother. Tinted lens. I hardly knew ya. Oh wait, you're not fucking faster. <gasps> I forgot you're not faster. Oh, uh, that's bad. What if you're at 55? What if you're at 56? The little Mothem that could. All right. All right, Mothem. You get to go to 56, Patty. Hopefully we don't need Mothem for anything else. I'm gonna take a nap. Maybe I'll see you later if you're still live. All right, have fun. Probably won't be, but see you in a bit anyways. All right, what is this Probo Pass's deal? Also, what am I using Agatha for? Right, the Houndoom. What? What's your what's your special attack like? Yeah, okay. So we definitely go power gem. Ah, dee dee da. No. What else can you learn? Eh. Eh. Kind of lame. Kind of weenie. Pretty weedy, SpongeBob. That's fine. We'll just do that. Um, and then Agatha. It was Agatha all along. We just protect. Faint attack on homie. Nice try, demons. Egad, we're out of leftovers. Doesn't matter. All right, let's go. Let's cockadoodle do it. Yay, Saturn! I'm on a mission to Saturn to be the lady that's named after the planet we're going to. Do do do. No mods, no mods, no mods. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! 
All right. What a what a what's the deal with these little beans, huh? Perugly Houndoom Scun Tank. Okay. Well, surely we just dodge them. Surely we just duck dodge them. Sucker. What's this one? Houndoom? <laughs> no. Let's do that one. Um, okay. Ah! Okay. And then Skun Tank is another one. Go the long way round. Nice try. You ain't getting me, suckers. Mission is proceeding with no issues. The boss should be pleased. Everything is for everyone and for the good of Team Galactic. You. I know you. You're the child who raided the Team Galactic building in Eterna. It was also you who interfered with us at the Pokemon Mansion. Humph! For your continued opposition of Team Galactic, you will be crushed. All right, pro bro pass. Hello, TJ. How you doing? All right, pro bro pass. Uh, well, not yet. Kingpin first. Go for Sucker Punch. It's probably going to fail because it's probably going to go for Calm Mind. But once it sees the kill, it will do just that. And then our ultimate planana will happen. <laughs> now you're dead. Goodbye. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead and out of this squirrel. All right. 53. Definitely going stony edge here. So you go to the cash master. The cash man can. It's muscle band. Spooky. Way to take it, Quake. Well, we don't have Protect. That's fine. Surely it still only sees the kill with Seed Bomb on Octillery, right? Octillery Clinton, back at it. Pokemon go to the polls. I'm just trying to get everyone to Pokemon Go to the polls. We really didn't appreciate what we had, folks. Octillery Clinton. A woman. All right. Now homie's gonna go gunk shot with Toxic Croak. So here's the plan. Octillery Clinton, a woman. That's what I'm saying, you know? 
All right, so we start with a switch to Polaris on hopefully a gunk shot. Uh, I would feel sheepish if it was not a gunk shot. Now, one gunk shot. Welcome to the team, Polaris. Two, one gunk shot. This is cross chop, presumably. Presumably, blah, blah, blah. So now we go. Sweet angel. Let those wings fly, my boy. The only thing that this doesn't work against is crit cross chop into crit bullet punch or sucker punch. Actually, I think just crit sucker punch is enough here. So, fingies crossed, folks. Fingies fucking crossed. Protect for some recovery. Sucker punch crit kills anyways. Yeah, you want to go gunk shot, don't you, you greedy boy? You greedy, greedy boy. And we guarantee out speed with the f level 56. Psychic from Angel. That's how you use a Motham, baby. With a three level advantage. Boom, shakalaka. All right, now what? Now it's, uh, it's just Bronzong, right? Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have taught this U-turn for some chippy Roo. Oh, although actually that would have been stupid because it could have missed. And then we would have been risking a crit kill. So glad I didn't do that. All right, Aggie, in you go. Probably should have taught this um, Will-O-Wisp, though I guess it doesn't ultimately really matter. All right, 10% bright powder, will it proc? You know, Clefable Table, you're doing an awful lot of song puns for the person that was like, stop. Yep, bright powder does proc. Can I get another 10%? Fire Red, tell us what Heart Gold stands for. I've always wondered, too. I'm sorry, I don't understand what you're saying. Hey, hey, Bronzong. Do you like apples? Perfectly accurate move. How do you like them apples? I'm gonna watch that movie again. There's nothing you can do to stop me. You try to stop me, you'll have to kill me. All right, so that's um. That's that's the lady with the hair. Great. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Now we ride to Salt Gem Town or whatever. Um, at some point I gotta get going. Eh, whatever. What's next, idiot? Jesus. <laughs> Jesus! Um, Mars, I guess. We can do Deathless Mars. Please send me good vibes. Prelims are stressful as all get out. Good luck, obsessive fan number one. <sighs> well. Yeah, you know what? We'll do Mars. Why the F not? 
A bunch of bugs is the first thing. Some fucking bugs. Beautiful eye, Butterfree, Dust Dogs, Beedrill. Why don't we just lead two fire types and go to Tiki Town? Beautifly and Dust Dogs. They're level 50, so I mean, surely. 107, we outspeed and one shot both of those. Dust Dogs. We outspeed and. Ooh, we don't outspeed B drill, but it doesn't matter. Because surely we can just kill, or we can just slap a choice scarf onto that. Where's uh, my other fire type? Margaret, Margaret Mortar, there you are. Girl. Realistically, Groot's gonna be more better than Angel. All right. Magmortar, though, is only 99. Rut row. No, wait. It's only 111. So it doesn't outspeed B drill, but it outspeeds everything else. Right? Yes. Okay. So Houndoom has to kill the B drill. Oops. Kill Beedrill here with Flamethrower? Okay. If you say so. Honey, where are my pants? I. So, wait. None of these homies. Ooh, Dust Ox has Protect, so we shouldn't hit into the Dust Ox. Uh Five minute movie review for a high school musical? Ugh. Never have I felt so seen and again when when I watched high school musical. I don't know, it's it's fine. You know? What do you want me to say? It's a DCOM. It's one of the better DCOMs. It was a sensation. It swept the nation. But I mean, yeah, it was it was solid. I do like Stretch, it's fine for five minutes. I saw the Iron Claw, it's great. Zac Efron's fantastic, yeah. I've always really liked Zac Efron as an actor, and I've always been like, it's a diggity damn shame that he's not the best at picking projects. But I will say, sometimes he strikes gold. He's good in 17 again. Uh, that's a pretty funny movie, R rather underappreciated. I do also like him in, uh, well, the movie's not that good, but he's good in the uh, Ted Bundy movie or whatever. Um, and then he's in... Um, he's in something else that I can't remember, but yeah, I don't know. High School Musical was a, a large part of my childhood faux show. So, um, but I'm not sure what else to say about it. Like, it's definitely good, you know? Baywatch. Yeah, he's fine in Baywatch. He's just like, 
Baywatch is not a good movie. Baywatch is a very, very bad movie. Oh yeah, he isn't the, the disaster artist. He's barely in it, but I suppose he's pretty good in that. But yeah, High School Musical, catchy songs. Um, they were cowards not to make Ryan actively gay, but they fixed that in the series, I think. All right, Nidorino, Golbat, Wormadame, Nidorina, Golbat, and Mothin. What does one do with this information? 99 and 108. Which, which, which worm a dame is it? It's a grass one. Cool. Um, okay. Holy shit, this Nidorino has head smash? Um, respectfully, why? All right, well. Let's give this guy choice specs. Give this guy charcoal. Yo, T-D-O-S Rizzy. Thank you for the sub. I really appreciate it. Chaco. Are you guys talking about Ryan and Sharpay? You guys are being silly. Um, I suppose I could just do this not as a double battle, huh? Ah, oh, well. What are you going to do? It's just a little too late, a little too long. And I can't wait, you know. All the right things to say You know it is a little too late Which one has choice specs? Agatha? Cool. Or just a bunch of silly geese. You say so. <laughs> Meat cleaver. The double G bat? Ooh, Nelly. Oh. Ooh, 
Martinelli. They got that G-Bad so Just air slash and Zen heady butt. Yeah, so this is fine. Uh... It can't confuse me or anything, right? It's just nasty plot. Yeah. Crit, 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 crit. Retro, he's plotting something nasty. Oh, he's plotting something nasty. Oh, I'm plotting something nasty over there. <coughs> oh, God. Uh... You know me, just plotting something nasty over here. <laughs> Um, great. Okay. Why do I tune into this stream? Because you've lost control of your life? Why does anybody do anything? Because you're a cog in the capitalist machine, baby. All right, um, let's figure out this lady and then go home. Crobat, Yanmega, Bronzong, Kangaskhan, Ugly. Crobat 52. Okay. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna bot. You know what? I am gonna do it because I like getting mad. Check this kid out. With Choice Scarf at 54, how much does Thunderbolt do? Nada. Does not get the kill. Bright Powder? Oh, go fuck yourself. Seriously? Why? I mean, you can't do anything to uh, Swamperto. I'm, uh, no, sorry, the Provo Pass. I don't really want that exploding homie coming out, though, this Bronzong. Although, then again, doesn't that give me a free switch to Provo Pass? Pro Bro Pass? Eventually, dude's just gonna explode himself into a thousand pieces. Cut my life to pieces! Wow, this is funny. This It's because of Detect it comes out. This is my last resort! Do -do -do -do. Um, I just need a way to damage him ever so slightly. Does this have leftovers? Ugh! Fucking guy. You know what? I'll take it. Go.
cut my life to pieces. This is my last record. Um, eventually it'll just explode. What was I going to do with the... Uh... As Choice Scarf Glaceon? It's a little weird, but... Choice Scarf Asleep Glaceon? No, I'll just... I'll just... I'll just... I'll just get, get it. It's fine. Worst case, we just probe it. Cut my life to pieces. This is my last resort. Alright, so what is this like? Closer to this. Maybe Probopass is not the answer to our prayers. Maybe I should just switch on a Focus Sash to Magmortar. That doesn't work. Where's my Aegis Slash when I need it? Um. Wait. Bruh. Probo Pass plus Focus Sash Crawdont. No, because Can Armaldo learn Shadow Claw? Ah, Gyroball does too much. Dude, this this freaking guy. This fucking guy. It's a big ask for pass. Unless Probo Pass can learn something. Probably pass can't learn Shadow Ball, can it? <laughs> nope. Can't even learn payback. 
What can you learn, Probopass? Nothing? A big bag of nothing? Guys, this Bronzong's a D-bag. I just want to wipe that. Um, all right, sand slash. Dude, explosion. like not maybe can we maybe not do I have damp no I mean I don't have to use Glaceon I can use something else for Crobat like Probopat Yeah, that's fine. Fine. Probo pass. Kills that. Kills that. Then you come out. You're going to want a hammer arm. You've got scrappy, so let's not oopsie doops this, but, um,. I feel like going between you on Altaria. Double Edge does Gangbusters, damn. But then we can just hammer arm until, well, you're gonna hammer arm until you're slower. Glaily learn Brick Break?
All right, we'll go crow, uh, toxic crow. Where is toxic crow? Body Slam and Play Rough and Hypnosis and Fake Out. That's Probo Pass and also Mawile is fine. Steel types really crush her team. Yeah. And then Zong is last and will never explode, so we can always go to Mag and take the kill to the choice specs flamethrower. <laughs> Ring Glalie too, cause why not, you know? Good into this, homie. All right. I don't like this crowbat though, I gotta say. the best way to memorize the periodic table element by element i don't know is this a joke or an actual question is this is this a, a gag is this a, a skit is this one of your skits Being able to purchase Focus Ashes in this game makes it so much simpler. Not simpler, but like doable, I guess, is, is the right word for it. Um,
Have I ever tried doing a wedlock? I have not, no. Seems really complicated. All right, Mars. Let's get this over with, lady. I def have what it takes. It doesn't seem particularly difficult. No offense. It just seems needlessly complicated. Honestly. Get her done. All right. Sup, Dr. Wombal HG, how's it going? It's going well for now. Man, if Probopass had recover, mm, these hills would sing. Deathless dream, baby. Let's do it. Commander Mars. She leads with a crowbat with bright powder. That's why we have shockwave. But first, we will set up stealth rock to better deal with the little, uh, the little, the little, little shit. Go ahead. Double team all you want, chief. In fact, I encourage you to keep double teaming. Don't do that. All right. Ugh. <laughs> All right. Pro Polaris, not you're not doing too hot quite yet. I would like you to do slightly hotter. I think this is like a four hit kill, unfortunately, so we may be here a while. Oh my god, that doesn't even look like a four hit kill. If Giga Drain doesn't do squat. Now it might be a five hit. It's definitely gonna be a five hit kill with the Giga Drain recovery. Uh, we're still, we're still over 50. Okay, okay, okay with that. Ha! Um, does Mars heal? I guess we'll find out together, huh? Ha! <laughs> okay. Crisis averted. Sort of. Take my prime sub. Hey, thank you, Cal. For the three months, wow. 60% of the time, it works every time. All right. Give me that good, good 50%. Again, yummy. Now, yeah, Mega, why would you do that? Why would you do that? Is it because you see it as a fighting type move? And you're a bit dense? Is that what's happening here? Bug Buzz flinch or does it just drop spadef? I 
think it just drops Spadef, right? All right, good job, Probo Pass. Uh, I'm gonna protect for a turn, because why not? I'm gonna go fake out, I think. Ah, I just wants to go hammer arm. Okay, I see you. We go to Taskmaster, the one and only. Masky mask, the tasky mask. Nice job, Taskmaster. So freaking proud of you, bro. You don't even know. You don't even know. I can make your hands clap. All right, so now this is going double edge, presumably. I guess it could go, no, no, no. It's always going double edge. So we can go Polaris again. I can make your hands clap. Every night when the sun goes down, am I the only living soul around? Um, all right, that was quad resisted, decent damage, not gonna lie. Um, I can make your hands clap. So it should be hammer arm again, right? Right, right, Bueller, Bueller, yep, okay. I can make your hands clap. All right, here's what's gonna happen, Kangaskhan. You're gonna miss this, because that would be funny. Not what I said, Chief. That is not what I said. Um, Actually, shoot, I don't think we guarantee the kill on this after this, oopsies. Ah. All right, we got to go back. Nah, Probo Pass wasn't a needed encounter, but it definitely helps a hell of a lot. It may be a needed encounter uh, against the double battle, the multi. I don't know. We'll see. Your hands clap. All right, that's more than enough damage. I can make your hands clap. I can make your hands clap. Every night when the sun goes down, am I the only? I probably should have protected against for the probo pass to get a little bit more damage but it is what it is polaris could at least leave some crumbs for the little baby a little baby what's up dave clue youtube long time long time amigo long time uh this is probably just going fake out so we'll go iron man might just in hypnosis i guess Ah, can't get paralyzed this way, baby. Not, I did not appreciate that, Iron Man. Dude, can we, can we, can we, can we, come on, come on, come on! Getting lucky, lucky with the sleep turns. Those were double one turn sleeps and two hypnosis misses. All right, hypno miss. 
Yeah, baby. Wow. 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 Can I get another? I guess I should be a little more careful. Body same crit does like 50%. Are you still going for hypnosis, or have you resided to do being a silly Sillerson? Oh, you're being a silly Sillerson. I could get paralyzed here, but... <laughs> Time is a circle. Time is a circle. All right, let's try this. Damn it. Thought I could be slick. I'm going to get paralyzed here, aren't I? Now when I go for it though, it's going to it's going to do that thing. Sleep talk's kind of ass. Wow, double body slam, no para. This might be the least lucky Mars I've ever seen. What's next? It's just Bronzong, right? Bronze zong zong zong. I bet. got leftovers but that doesn't matter we do have choice specs on this homie right yup all right that's the that's the galactic grunts and admins beaten Cool, 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 cool. Torch getting mighty close to that level cap, though. We gotta watch that. Probably gonna need him for the uh, canvas fight. All right. Great. Um, cool. Well, this was fun. This was fun. Um, guys, we still didn't. We still didn't do freaking. We still didn't do the horse stream, the horse rankings. I've let us down. Die. Okay. Um. All right. That's going to be it for the end of stream, though. Um, maybe we'll do some stuff on Thursday. We'll hopefully try and get to Candace by Thursday, I think. Um, let's hop into a raid. Let's raid the Pokemon channel. Um, oh, wait, wait, wait. Did, did we not resolve the prediction? Let's do that, too. Choose outcome. Wow, you guys were pretty confident. Let's go ahead and raid, um... We'll raid Salt Queen. Is that who I think it is? Do I know who Salt Queen is? Yeah, 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 yeah. It looks like they're doing some Kaizo Iron Mon stuff. Now we always raid Akko. Kind of do every other stream rage wacko, you know? <laughs> um, 
Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Go have some fun. Spam the flag on emotes. Thanks for hanging out. See y'all on Thursday is the plan, okay? All right. Peace.